PW rally in Kogi looking like a naming ceremony shows that Labour Party has been rejected. Ahmad, welcome to the news and please subscribe to the channel to get notified when we post hot juicy news updates. Please click on the notification bell. Special Assistant to President Mohammed Buhari Bashar Ahmed has reacted to the turnout of supporters at the Obidati rally in Kogi. It is no longer news that the Labour Party residential aspirant Peter Gregory B and his friendly mate Yusuf Dati Baba Ahmed were in Lokoj on Tuesday for the continuation of their campaign ahead of a general election in 2023. The visit to Kogi came after the party's last out in Imo and Taraba respectively and after the party officially flagged up in Nasarawa a few months ago. Reacting to the crowd recorded at the venue, Bashar Ahmed said that the gathering was more like a naming ceremony after he considered those who attended to be very few. He said the turnout of the people that the party recorded at the conference stadium has shown that the party has been rejected going into the general election in 2023. His post on Twitter read thus. The Labour Party presidential campaign rally in Kogi was a confirmation that Nigerian voters have completely rejected the party and its candidate even before the polls. An embarrassing turnout, the stadium was sparsely populated as if it's a local naming ceremony was taking place. For every time the APC comes out and talks about Labour Party, I feel that, should I say, they're drunken in love with these people? Because if you, the last time I checked, they said these people do not have... The APC, they are still of the opinion, some of them, or some of them are of, of the opinion that, you know, these people, they, they, are, they, are not, they have no structure, that they, have, they don't have what it takes to win an election. I say winning an election is what we're talking about here. We're talking about, you know, somebody who will come in and make Nigeria a better country for all of us. But um, a few members of the All Progressive Club has come out and stayed open to you that truly the Labour Party is a force to be reckoned with. So, so every time they come outside and even focus on Labour Party, I'm like, you know, Labour Party, they focus on these people. Why are people focusing? And I mean, people who are supposed to be pushing for them without even mentioning the Labour Party. If not just saying, I just support us now for online platform, you say, okay, fine. But this one, people in the presidency, around the presidency, are coming about speaking for Labour Party. When they're supposed to be saying, spreading the gospel of the APC, spreading the gospel of Asiwaju, and you know he's friendly with Shetima. <laughs> okay. Amesh, you have to be ashamed of yourself. Anybody who loves Nigeria with sincerity of heart cannot support APC to crowd. No. Ahmed is feeding from APC. Just know that. Ahmed is feeding from APC. So there is absolutely no way he's going to be thinking right and coming to there is no way he will think right and you his thinking right will now be to come out and support another party. Never ever. Just like Femi Adeshina today. He is not supporting um, any other part, political party because of where he's feeding from. Ha! Knowing fully well what Yabele could do, I am sure people decided to hide their heads before ta 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 we take the place. What do you mean by ta ta ta? <laughs> hey, what do you mean by ta ta ta? I don't understand. Who. Well, Kogi State people, now so it be, in a governor, a rugged man. Make an tell us or make we know. Shall naming ceremony crowd have volunteer themselves is better than a large hired crowd. You forget that Obi of Biafra Ibo Aipo president hired people in Badun where when they gave them five hundred dollars each, but now no money again. Sorry, I feel your pain. Ahmed, let that they confess that we're gonna no like I'm not uh, I'm not about um this predicting of elections. Me I want to make the thing they happen. Make with the same koro koro make it happen. Hmm? Okay. No worries, it will shock you that day. After we might not win all the state, but eventually emerge as president come twenty three. Bet me. <laughs> because now this must be the best this issue. I know one year say somebody carry my wife go. Like during the time on the lighter note, there was a time there was this Chelsea um just like they're playing FIFA World Cup now. They were saying that it's Chelsea and, um, was it Chelsea and Manu? And people bet, people use their land. Some people, their houses. I'm telling you. Men do, men do a lot of irrational things. So I am telling you. And at the end of the day, what happened? I even, I, I don't know if somebody even bet his wife. I'm just joking. 
That was in that a lot. But the thing is, why is APC interested in the Labour Party so much? Why are they not coming out to scream out their lungs about the, the political party? Why not advertising their candidate? Huh. All the attention is not turned to Labour Party. There is something wrong here. Okay, only of all people, even someone will get. Okay, will be of all people, even someone will get with Fasim. Okay, you mean Shagun? Okay, not. Only. Yes, he deserves no vote, but Obi of all people, as you rightly put it, is your next president. <laughs> Some people carry violence, they work out for her that they tell on her. <sighs> okay. Yes, because these people came out and not rented APC, are not rented like APC always rent their crowds. Like I said, let Ahmed wait for. Let Ahmed wait for 2020. What, uh, what's it called? Let him wait for the due day. Ahmed, please be polite to obedient by saying that the rally was in house sports event. Can you imagine? But if people said they obedient when they exist on Twitter, that number which gathered in Kogi means so much and will change the narrative on the election day. Can't you see that you, Tunebu, that your Tunebu could not answer one question on Chatham House? I think uh, that is not even what we're discussing here. Okay. Can you compare it with Tunubu that was booed in Kaduna before the Emma's Palace? Wahala. Okay. Obi is the next president of Nigeria. By God's great, a new Nigeria is sure. Guy, do not deceive yourself. He cannot smell it. It is very shameful that I see basket in ignorant and willing to wallow more in this translation when it is crystal clear that P2B is more sound and capacitated than his rivals. You are still considering sentiment in your judgment to choose the right person. You are not almighty God to decide who will be there. You only have one vote for it, one vote to yourself, and you cannot represent the entire populist vote. The turnout in Ogi can be used. The turnout in Ogi cannot be used as a yardstick to know who will win. Ahmed was so dashed in bringing to judge on that. However, all your predictions is given to Nobu and Atiku small odds against Ubi. It might surprise you to do a big odd winning in this political game. So go and have everything so that you will not stick your mind on the bigger odd that will turn your life around. <laughs> okay. It appeared so for the fear of Finchant. The people of Kogi will vote the right person on election day. And that person is Peter Gregory B. People are just concerning themselves instead of saying they will work harder. Forget stories disappointing, simple and short. They're not. Obi will only do well in Southern Kaduna, Taraba, Plateau, Benue. Labour Party presence is close to zero in other states. Well, Obi to be obedience. We're going to take advice from that person and no say, you're going to get plenty of work to do. All right, on this note, we've come to the end of the news. We say thank you for telling me to listen. Until I come here next time, enjoy the rest of your day. <laughs>